Hello kindergartners hope you are all doing great and enjoying your online classes today we are going to learn about another interesting concept that is estimation in this lesson we are going to learn to make a sensible estimation of a few or several number of objects that can be checked by counting up to 10 do you know what the word estimate means Think about where you might have heard the word estimate or estimation. Keep thinking little ones and listen to the song. So kindergartners, what do you think estimation is all about? Well tried! When you make an estimation, you make a smart guess. What that means is that you look at what you have or what you know and then you make a guess. Well, in everyday life, you will hear people use those words as if they mean the same. But estimation and guessing are totally different. A guess is a prediction based on little or no evidence and has no real method. An estimation is a prediction based on some evidence. It is a rough calculation of the value, number, quantity or extent of something to form an opinion. You estimate when there are too many of some things to count. Like, look at the stars in the sky. Kindergartners, can you count them? Yes, I agree. There are way too many to count. So, it can't be the exact count, but you can give an estimate. What estimation do you make here? How many stars do you think you see? I agree. They are countless. Look at this flock of birds. You can never count all these birds, but you can estimate how many there are. So what's your estimation, in the gardeners? Hmm, well tried. My estimation is that they are more than 200 birds. Kindergartners, now get ready to estimate amounts. In a minute, you will see some magic eggs. But you won't see them for long. Try and remember how many magic eggs you saw and make an estimation. Later, we will count them to recheck. Are you ready? How many magic eggs did you see? Share your estimation. Well estimated. Not a bad try. There were seven magic eggs. Let's move on. Make a quick estimation. Say out your number loud. How many magic eggs did you see this time? Great observation. Your estimation was close to the number. Let's check. There are 10 magic eggs. It was fun estimating numbers. Now it's quiz time. Let's look at these turtles. So what do you think is a good estimation for how many turtles are there in this picture? Hmm, three? No, that's probably too low. Keep estimating. You estimated correctly. Yes, maybe 10 or 15. Now estimate how many beads are there in this jar. Are these a hundred beads? What do you think? 
Bravo! These beads are way less than 100. So what's your estimation? Well estimated, maybe 8 or 10. Now let's estimate how many pages are there in this book. Look at these pages really carefully. Simply splendid, you made your best estimation. It looks like probably there are 10 to 12 pages in the book. So dear kindergartners, let's recall today's learning. Superb! You used what you could see and what you knew to make an estimation. Remember, when you estimate, you don't have to be exact and you don't have to be right. I'm so proud of you all. You are all great estimators. Download worksheet number one uploaded in the folder about estimation. Well, that's the end of the lesson. See you soon and until then, keep estimating.